welcome to our temporary home here at the Waldorf Astoria in Las Vegas, Nevada. We love it here in a bizarre way, partly because this hotel room is excellent. It feels so good to be here with my beautiful, gorgeous wife. And we are in Las Vegas. It feels good. It's great to remember how fortunate we are and to be surrounded by fortune so that it's easier to remember that. It's like the space is really big so that we can fill the space. So what do we have? Grand sweeping views of the city. Which, when we bring you over here, it's like you can see the parking lots. But actually, generally speaking, when you're just in the room, all you see is the mountains, the sky, and these beautiful architectural manifestations of human intelligence. I love having so much space. I like to spread out. And in a hotel room like this, I, you can't even tell that I'm here almost. I'm very, very, very excited to use this. We're about to go to the spa, or I will be in it already. A round hot tub. Salts that smell really good. I love it when they like add in these details. It's so important that when you travel, you feel like you're elevating. <sighs> I love being able to look out at this magic no matter what I'm doing. It's so cool. And I will say, I'm learning the power of the bidet. This one has the most important quality, which is warm water. Very, very, very important. Got some of our essential oils, just to make sure that we're, we're beaming at the level that we can. Put a little spruce on to match my man. And there's something really powerful for me about like, like, I feel more on retreat and in a kind of sanctuary here, even though we're in the midst of all of this, it's almost like because we're in the midst of all of this, I feel the permission to really go inward. <sighs> Look at this freaking dining room with the chandelier and then this massive living room. <sighs> You're right, we could do contact in this space. We should move the tables and just dance here. That would be awesome. So it just feels like, ah, we can really take up space. I like to be able to take up space. To make it my own. This is our altar for the moment. Some parts we bring with us, some, some parts we kind of make with what's here in the hotel room. And then our cards for the day with some stones past shadow very relevant for us that we've done a lot of work looking at the truth of who we are coming into this the wildling bringing in our inherent nature our wildness our permission to be truly ourselves and step out of the confines of convention and then destruction which feels like a very auspicious card at the new year you know to just like clear out space for the new so, really super honored to be here. So grateful to be with my beautiful husband and to go into retreat together in this beautiful, luxurious space. I could live here. I have actually had the thought to spend a year living in fancy hotels. Traveling from city to city, not paying rent. This place would be like 1,000, 1,500 bucks a night. We would easily spend half a million dollars in that year if we decided to do that just on our stay. But you know, they cover so much, so I don't know. I don't think it quite works out to be equal, but it's an interesting concept. All right, know that we're thinking of you and send us your love and blessings for a transformational retreat. Thank you.